Well, it's a beautiful day for football. No complaints whatsoever on that front here at Old Trafford. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Manchester United, and they take on Arsenal. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes round the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea starts in goal. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Marcus Rashford. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And leading the line today is Gabriel Jesus. Potentially one to savour. Arsenal get this game underway. They could really get at the opposition. And options in the centre. However, up a dead end. Delivering it. Growing pressure here, and another corner. Over it comes. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Gabriel Jesus prepared to fire. Not the best clearance. Danger averted for now. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Can he put it away? He can't hold on to it. Just the challenge that was required. Marcinelli. Martin Odegaard. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Well, not the best piece of finishing we've ever seen. Marcus Rashford. Bruno Fernandes has it. Jaden Sancho. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Can he put them in front? But it was a wonderful chance. But the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper. But surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Corner kick played in. Defensive excellence there. They're making high pressing work for them here. Bruno Fernandes fed over towards the back post. That's a great stop. Will he chance to take the lead? Thomas. Martin Odegaard. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, the threat is there. And into the net from Gabriel Jesus.
Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And then it's a pretty tidy finish too. Hits it hard, he hits it low, and it just makes it difficult for the keeper. A really nice goal. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. This might have potential. Thomas Partey. Great opportunity! And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? An Arsenal corner as they look for more. Well, not cleared away completely. It might be. Sensational goalkeeping from David De Gea. And a good tackle. Xhaka. And here's Partey. Gabriel Jesus and De Gea, absolutely brilliant goalkeeping. Casemiro. Malasia. Ericsson has found an attacking gear. But what's his approach going to be now? And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Well, he's walking a fine line. No caution, though. Well, the referee's made it quite clear, hasn't he? Next foul, and he will get a booking. enough Stuart well I think he should do better there but at least they're now knocking at the door and they need to get tighter but ultimately up a cul-de-sac not a good pass crossing possibilities can't miss surely well somehow the goalkeeper got to it well it's been a while but these fans are now coming to life can they equalize here Playing it in, determined block, another corner conceded, what can they do with this one? And over from Ericsson, and miles off target with the header, but in fairness, the marking was tight. Granit Xhaka, Marcinelli. Here's Gabriel Jesus. And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Well, it took a deflection. That'll be a corner. Who can they pick out? Not messing around with that clearance. Granite Jacker. They could pick out a teammate. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Rashford. Now Casemiro. And threading it forward. It's still alive. On well, a time for composure on the ball. 
And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, Marcus Rashford really muzzled by the opposition. And honestly, who saw that coming, Stuart? He just hasn't been able to affect the game so far. He hasn't had too much of the ball, but even when he has, he's not looked threatening. So the ball is rolling again. United might be behind, but still plenty of time for them. What can they do in the second 45? Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Marcinelli. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. Jaden Sancho. Sancho. Oh, surely! And a really good diving stop. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. And clearing it away. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Tommy Yasu. Thomas now. Well, keeping it on the ground. Slightly off target, however. Martin Odegaard. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Sloppy in possession from Arsenal. The ball back with Arsenal now. And flag raised, offside. Well, that was always going to be offside. He just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer. And time for the change now. Bruno Fernandes and here is Manassia Bruno Fernandes has it and into the last 30 minutes now well they're sitting ever deeper possession and patience the watchwords well didn't go to plan in the end well as you can see Arsenal haven't had that much of the ball but when they have had it They've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Well, that's one for them to pursue. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Clearing their lines. And so it will be a corner now. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Foiling them effectively. Partey. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Well, they so nearly took the lead there. They just have to keep creating these opportunities, and I'm sure the goal will come. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Defenders need to cover. Well, he strayed offside, just as it looked promising. Thomas. Granite Jacker. A chance to whip it in. Able to skip past his man. 
the cross. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Still not clear. Opportunity. What a save. Well, these fans are driving their team on here, but can United find a winning goal? Not long left now. Rashford unable to hold it. And a goal at this stage could be decisive. Will he finish? Still a chance. And now a corner. Can they take advantage of it? Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number 10, Marcus Rashford. Coming onto the pitch, number 7, Cristiano Ronaldo. And over it comes. Not the best clearance. Gabriel Jesus. Well, able to close down the shot. Partey. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Well, the atmosphere is so tense inside this stadium. But can they find that moment of magic to win this game? The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to them. Bruno Fernandes must take the lead here. Oh, he's been foiled. How pivotal could that be at this stage of the game? Well, it was a good save, but that was the chance to win the game there. That could be their last opportunity. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Number nine, Anthony Martial. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Casemiro. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance. And the fans are lapping this up. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Manchester United. It will be very instructive to see how Arsenal respond to that setback. Substitution for Manchester United. Granit Xhaka. Number 14, Christian Eriksen. To be replaced by number 39, Gabriel. Are still pressing for a goal here, but really sticking to the task defensively. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, what a good finish to the game that was. They just wore down the opposition, and in the end, they got their reward. That's a really good win for them. Well, we're focusing on Cristiano Ronaldo for a reason, Stuart. Fair to say, he's been at his brilliant best. Well, he's the match winner, and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.